Hello and welcome back to Andrea Saves. I'm Andrea and today we are going to do the large challenge binder. These are large in size, not large in cost, and see how far our money can go today. So this is 20, 45, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I have $55 today to stretch it into these envelopes that I am saving for various expenses. Alrighty. So first up is our Wordle Savings Challenge. This is by Two Sister Bees. And I did this week this one last week. This week I owe $18. I had a really, really bad week on guesses this week. So I owe $18. So what I have to do is I have to put in 28 and take out a 10 because I don't have the change otherwise. So we have the 10 from last week and we have the 18 from this week. So we have 25, 26, 27, 28 dollars. <throat> All right. And this is to show where I ended last week and this is just to cover today's word so that nobody gets it from just having to watch a video and you still have a chance if you want to play this to play this game. This is by Two Sister Bees and I am doing this in a challenge with my mom and I'm not doing very good this month. So I cross my fingers and hope something better comes along. Next up is our YouTube monetization tracker. This one is by D versus Debt, and I have been keeping track of the subscribers and the watch hours. And this week I have 374 subscribers and 1325 watch hours. So I do not get to color in any of the circles for the subscribers, but I get to color in one of the circles for the watch hours. So I am going to add my dollar to this challenge and then I'm going to take this challenge out and rest it for a while. Um, I don't like having to watch to see how many subscribers I have all at one time every week. You know, it's not moving and flowing very well. So I'm going to put this aside for a few weeks and see how that does. And then we can look at bringing it back. But right now I have 50, 61, 62, and 63. And this money will stay in here as long. Well. And the, um, the challenge will just get moved to a different area of my binder so that it is not right here every week to do for a little bit. All right. I do appreciate you if you are here, if you have subscribed, if you're watching. I really appreciate it. All right. This is the Starbucks tracker. These are for star notes. And if you don't know what a star note is, it's any American bill that has had to be reprinted on the serial number, there will be a star at the end. And I do not have any this week. I'm waiting for at least one so that I can finish this paper up and we can count all of this money in this big envelope. Okay, next up is the I Want My Money Challenge. This one is Michelle Free to Fly Life, and she has made this for Halloween. But this challenge, I am making it punny, and I am going to do this to save up for going to visit my mom and dad who live out of state. And so this week we are going to put $10 in this and color in one of these little mummy guys. I think the red one that we are doing today looks kind of like Elmo. <laughs> I know that's not what it's supposed to be, but coloring them in bright colors is kind of funny. So at the end of this challenge, I will have $420 and I will be able to go see my parents and have a week-long trip just for fun. All right, so I have 150, 170, 190, 200, 210, 212, 214, 16, 18, 
19 and 20. And I am going to trade out these two tens here for a $20 bill. And that might let us get a little further in life today. All right. So this is the I Want My Mummy Challenge by Michelle Free to Fly Life. Next up is the Santa's Little Helper Challenge. This is by Lisa Grateful Me at the Happy Mailbox Co. This was a freebie. This was to help save up a dollar each week to help out somebody in need. And so I am saving $3 for each of these hats because I have three children still living at home. I am a mom of four, but one of mine is an adult and does not live at home. So for the three children at home, I'm putting $1 a week and at Christmas time or between Thanksgiving and Christmas, we will each, they will each help figure out where that money is going to go help. So that is what I'm doing here is I am saving. So this week I'm going to put $6 in there. So we are color two of these little hats. I know that I mess up all of these. I don't do them all the way they're supposed to be done, but instead of having to color three different pages and print out three, I know that I'm just going to do three for each one of these. And then when we get closer to Christmas, we will be able to help. So we have 55, 65, and 66 dollars saved up already. I uh, look forward to that. All right. Next up is the 365 Penny Challenge. And this one is by Beautifully Me and You. And we are going to put 10 in. And since I don't, I'm not going to fill this one in because this goes over 10, I'm going to put the 10 in for this $8 one. So this challenge, if you're doing it at the exact change that it states, you will save up $667.95. I am rounding up at least to the nearest dollar. This week I have the 10, so we are going to do the 8, 12, and we're on number 26, so we are officially halfway done with this challenge. And when we get to the end of this challenge, We'll out, take it all out and see how much we have saved up. Very exciting. Alrighty. This is just my tracker for my IRAs. So this year I am trying to max it out at $6,500. And so I'm, I have set it so that my accounts will take out $125 each week to automatically go and for 52 weeks that should add me up to the $6,500 to max it out. This will be my first year being able to max out an IRA which will be very exciting. So I have tracked it for today is May 12th and so we are almost through with our second line of tracking. Sorry for the jiggle. <laughs> And next up, we are going to do this 100 envelope challenge. And I do not have any change here, so we're going to stick in a 10 and color in a 6 on here and see. So I guess we'll end up with a little bit more, a couple dollars more than what we had to start with. So this one is going to go in my homemade 100 envelope challenge box. This challenge, the paper is a low income 100 envelope challenge or a low denomination. So we're on number 14. And all of the numbers are between 1 and 6. This is by Mandy's Budgeting Journey, previously Clark's on a Budget. And I will link everybody in the description box below so that you can check out their pages and see if you want to buy them. So I started this at the end of February and we've got 14 envelopes filled up already. So as stated, this will save $341. 
All right. I appreciate you. I hope you have a wonderful day. It is going to be hot and sunny here in Washington this weekend. So I am looking forward to wonderful weather. I hope you have a great weekend and I will see you in the next one. Bye.